All right, so third installment to my haul video. This is the Coupe de Gras. And trust me, I believe these are probably the creme de la creme of the whole entire haul video. Some people may disagree, but whatever the case may be, I'm glad you tuned back in. Stay tuned. So you're never going to believe what happened to me, y'all. But before I get to what happened, I want to tell you all, if you're a first time is here to this channel, my name is Keith. This is the Fragrant Life where we talk about everything fragrance related, whether it's down to the cheapest of the cheapies or the highest of niche. We talk about everything. If you're not a subscriber to this channel, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. Make sure you ring the bell icon for all notifications. Like these videos, thumbs up, share these videos, and be active in the comment section. And all of that costs you absolutely nothing. Trust me. So with that being said, let me adjust my camera a little bit. Now, so with that being said, I'm glad you stuck around. I know the last video was a little long, but some of you didn't care. And some people obviously have better things to do with their time. So they complained about the length of the video. It always tells you in the bottom right hand corner of every single video that you watch how long the video is going to be. If you don't have 30 minutes to spare, why even click on the video? But with that being said, let's move on. Like I said, this is probably the best of the best in my personal opinion of the other two videos that I've done, but that's just my personal opinion. Now I have more fragrances on the way. I actually got one in today and I may just unbox that one. Now something happened with my other video and if I would have uploaded it, you would have saw I was leaning down to pick up another fragrance and I hit the cord and all my audio went away so I started doing voiceover and I didn't like the way it was coming out it was just too many awkward silence moments in there and it just didn't look like my normal content so what I did was I scrapped that video I'm doing it over I'm losing the element of surprise um, I didn't put everything back in the boxes because to me that's like being fake and so what I did was the ones I didn't leave out of the boxes I pulled back down but the ones I did I just didn't put them back in so let's get started y'all the first fragrance I want to talk about is one that I saw and it seemed very interesting to me I love the bottle presentation when I saw it and I watched a couple of videos on it and the one video I watched I can't remember his name he talked so eloquently eloquently about this fragrance and it interests me even more it piqued my interest even more so i went ahead and i purchased it and it is from the house of nobile 1942 this is patchouli nobile and i know it's kind of hard to see because my ring light is crazy bright but that's the bottle has a nice little plaque i'm not sure if that's a sticker it could be but nice attention to detail on the bottle heavy metal cap plastic insert atomizer is to die for on this one and the scent is even better if you love the note of patchouli and fragrances you will definitely like this one this has a slight sweet element to it it's almost like a honeyed kind of sweetness to it it kind of reminds me of what is that fragrance? The Pasha de Cartier Parfum, I think it is. It kind of reminds me of that, but with patchouli in it. This is a gorgeous scent. I love this and I'm glad I have it in the collection. So from Nobile 1942, this is Patchouli Nobile. And this video, I'm not even, probably not even going to do any editing. I'm just going to give it to you raw, just like it is. It's just how it goes, y'all. All right, so next up, 
I have the boxes for these two. They're right up here. But the next one is from the House of Parfums de Marley. And this one is Percival. And ever since I smelled this fragrance in Nordstrom's about a year ago, I've been wanting this one and basically all of them because I liked everything they had. And I have the majority of them as of right now so far. I have a few more to go. Beautiful scent if you like that sweet, fresh, uh, almost fruity type fragrance. You can tell it's of the highest quality. I got all of these at great prices. So check out Macari. Um, it's just like eBay, it's nothing different. So, man, that is nice. I can't wait to give this some wearing. Percival by Parfums de Marley. All right, sticking with the Parfums de Marley theme, I had to get this one also. I had a decan of this one sent to me by a subscriber. I can't remember who it was, but I did like this scent a lot. I did wear it to work when I was still at the hospital at the time. No compliments with it, but I loved it anyway. This is Godolphin from the House of Parfums de Marley. Look at that gorgeous gold bottle. Fingerprint magnet galore, but hey, it's not about the bottle. Nobody's really going to see it. They just going to smell you and say you smell good. And I love this scent. Beautiful, beautiful scent. Parfums de Marley. Go Dolphin. Another beautiful scent that I had, I believe I had a sample of, and I wasn't blown away by it at first. But after smelling it and giving it some wearing later on, I started falling like everybody else did from the house of Nishane, Annie, or Ani, however you want to say it. I've heard it pronounced several different ways. Beautiful packaging, even more beautiful bottle. Gorgeous scent inside, definitely unisex. I'm not sure if that's like vanilla or something, but it smells fantastic. I love it. From the house of Nishane, Annie. Next up, if you're paying attention, there's a hole right there. There's a gap. That can only mean one thing. Another Zerjoff. Which one is this? I've been doing my homework and I picked up more than words. And this is a gorgeous scent also. This bottle is stunning. I love Zerjoff's bottle presentations. I love their boxes. And the juice inside is phenomenal. I love this. I let my girlfriend smell this one and she was livid because she <laughs> couldn't believe how good this smells. She liked this one a lot. So from the house of Zerjoff, more than words. And last but not least, uh, I am absolutely glad that this company switched to a 30 ml bottle and didn't do what Creed did. They made the bottle smaller or went to a 150 ml bottle and left the price what it was. But this company actually lowered the price as well as went to a 30 ml size. Still going to be out of some people's price range, but I couldn't pass. Thank you once again to Fragrance Fanatic Steve for sending me a decant of this fragrance or a carded sample of it. It's from the house of Argos, Triumph of Bacchus. And they also sent some goodies in the package. They sent a little bag. They sent a travel atomizer. They sent some carded samples. And this thing has great packaging also. Has a little flap here on the side that's magnetic. 
You open it up and look at that gorgeous bottle on the inside. Attention to detail. It goes a long way. Look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous bottle. And the atomizer. I'm going to spray this one. Look at this. Beautiful scent. Gorgeous scent. I just can't get enough of this one. Um, <laughs> this is all I need, but I'm almost kicking myself in the butt because if I start using this, I'm going to have problems and I'm going to run out and I'm going to be sick. But from the house of Argos, Triumph of Bacchus. Bacchus. And I believe that was everything I had. I looked just to make sure I didn't miss anything. And I don't think I did. I touched on Himalaya, Silver Mountain Water in the last video. Um, Black Afghano. I'm not sure if I talked about that one in the last video, but I did pick up Black Afghano, so I'm just gonna mention that one again. Um, I do believe that was about it. I don't see anything else that's catching my eye. I did get a package yesterday from another company, but I'll mention that in a separate video. I didn't wanna put that one in this haul. Man, that try off of Bacchus is doing his thing right now. Yeah, that's about it. Now, I did get another package today. And this one I also bought from Macari, believe it or not. And I paid, I think, $76 for this. And some people are going to be like, what? $76 for that? Yeah, I did. From Navatus Parfums, this is Absolutio Parfum. And if you don't know who makes this, Steven over at the channel Red Adolescence, this is one of his babies. And I could not pass this deal up. Um, I definitely would not pay or didn't want to pay the price that they were charging for it on their website. So I think this is a much, much better price in my opinion. I think most fragrances, in my personal opinion, I'm saying this this is just me. I wouldn't pay for cert some fragrances a certain amount, especially if you're getting like a cheap box presentation and you're getting a cheap cap and all that kind of stuff. Now, this looks good. I'm not going to sit here in front. I think I had a decan of this that I smelled before and I already knew what it smelled like. It's a gorgeous smelling scent. But people were saying that it smells like other things and I can't vouch for that because some of those fragrances I don't even own. But for what it is, it smells great. I haven't worn this yet, so I can't tell you the performance on it, but Absolutio Parfum by Navatus Parfums. It's a nice looking bottle. I wish the cap snapped in place, um, but I'm not being picky. I don't never pick up bottles by the caps anyway and the scent profile is not bad um, the lady that I bought this from on Macari she sent a card with it and said that she hopes I enjoy this more than she did whatever that meant but that was my last uh, package for today and I have I believe two I believe two more coming one said it will be here Friday. The other one, I'm not sure because the person hadn't shipped it off yet, but we'll see. So hopefully you all enjoyed this haul video and maybe sometime in the near future, I'll be able to do another one. Um, let me know in the comment sections what you thought about these haul videos and if you thought that this one was better than the other two or if you like one of the other two videos better. Um, and with that being said, y'all, here is to smelling great. Peace.